Hi everybody, QuintLearsNewHomesales.com. I'm with Warren Harris. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank you. And uh, which home builder do you represent? Uh, Abrazo Homes. What was that? What? Why were you hugging me? Abrazo actually means, um, has, has a translation to um, welcome or embrace. So, and we thought we thought starting the company with a warm welcome made a big difference for our clients. So it's all about feeling in this company. So, I love that. Warren, how long have you been in new home sales? Trying to find a way to break back into this business for 15 years and really didn't have the opportunity to. Um, and the next thing I know, I made, I made the leap and I stand here before you today. So uh, 15 years in the business. Congratulations. I mean, you've been there for the highs and the lows and the yeses and the noes. I mean, through the collapse, up th throughout the other side. What do you do different? You're very, very successful. I know you're a top producing um, new home sales professional. Tell me one, two or three things that you do different. Um, you know, I think I think kind of like um, what you sort of preach today in the, in the seminar is I go a bit off the off the beaten track. So I don't necessarily like to use sales techniques. I don't know that I'm really good at those, um, but I do know that I have an understanding and um, I have charisma and I have a connection with my with my clients and my customers. Um, and I think that makes a difference. I figure out what they're looking for. Um, and I think it helps them to understand the process, but it also befriends them. Um, so we are, we're looking, we're looking to um, kind of pursue this venture together. And I think that makes a difference for the, for the customer or the client. What is your favorite part about new home sales and what's your biggest challenge? Favorite part about new home sales? You know, uh, that might be twofold. Um, I do have to say I enjoy meeting people. I really, really do. Uh, the other thing is um, finding a place for them. You know, it's it sounds so generic and cliche, but the reality is to find a place for someone to to reside and bring their family to and and have a feeling of purpose and home, um, it makes a big difference for a family. So it really, really does. Um, as far as challenges are concerned, I think the challenges for me are, I hate to say this, but they're they are mostly me. Um, my challenges I, are, are internal. So um, with clients and seeing people and um, and uh, making sure I do do right by them. So so I, I think I always challenge myself inside. Um, as I meet the next person, um, I try to get better at what I do, um, maybe be more informative with a client, maybe listen a bit more with the next customer um, as well. So I, I, I try to think that I'm being progressive every time I'm introduced to a, to a new person. So, And we're at a conference up here and you've taken time away you know, from work and family and friends to be here. Why is that important to you? Well, you know... Um, with my history in the business, I you know I do I do find that sometimes uh, things get uh, a bit dull for me. So and it's difficult for me to even think about going to something outside. Um, but you know I thought at the same time every time I go, it's so invigorating for me. It makes it, it re excites me um, at, in this business to actually come out and do this. So I might drag my feet on the way there, but I'm I leave skipping. So if that makes sense. Really no, I, and I love your energy. You've been connecting with people all morning. Your big encouragement. I love that you gave me a big hug. Give me another hug, man. <laughs> it feels good, man. This business, we got to look out for each other. Any last words of encouragement, you know, for people that are thinking about getting into the business, that are, you know, concerned, challenged? Give, give me some encouragement for the frontline new home sales professional. You're the long-term veteran now. You know, um, I, I think that you've got to find your purpose. Um, find not only what you're good at, but what you enjoy. And if, if people see that you enjoy what you do, that will create an energy that you may have never seen before. And that's your sign that you're in the right place. So if that's what you enjoy and that's what you truly want to do, you don't give up. You keep going hard. Um, you don't stop just because the market gets a little, a little soft. Um, you understand your tools and your toolkit and you, you keep sharpening your tools. You know, Carpenter, if he's, if he's got a dull saw, he buys a new one or, or sharpens the one he has. Got to do the same thing. Look at the camera and tell that person, tell them not to quit. Somebody's thinking about Don't quit. Don't quit. Don't quit. I'm telling you, don't quit. Yeah. Yeah. 15 years in. 15 years. Any last words of encouragement? Um, uh, like Quinn said, don't quit. <laughs> thank you so much, Warren. It's a pre you. pleasure. Absolutely. No, man, give me a hug. Give me a hug. Don't do this. <laughs> Handshake. Come on, man. It's a Brazo Homes. You're the best, man. Check out newhomesales.com. Guys, please comment, subscribe, join our tribe. We're trying to create an online mastermind of some of the best people in the business. Thanks for taking time to give back. Thanks, brother. Thank you.